target one representing the United States of America, top ranks, Braden Gillenfeen. Representing New Zealand, Sean Teasdale. Teasdale advancing after his quarterfinal against Dean Marcellus. Nine for Galantine. And a nine for Teasdale. One o'clock, very close. Nine for Teasdale. Mid nine, 11 o'clock. Yeah. 10. Good shot. And the final error for Teasdale, an eight advantage yeah, on that four set. Four Going to Brayden Gillenpee, he picks up yeah. two points in the set. First one to six will win the match in advance for the opportunity to compete for the title. Uh, just so you have an idea of the format, the losers of the semifinal bracket will advance to the consolation bracket for the last podium spot, and the winners of each bracket will advance to the final to compete for the title. Brayton Gellin being shooting 29, Deshaun Teasdale 26 in that first set. Uh, two tens for Gallantine in that particular set. Sean Teasdale, uh, that center of the target, has eluded him thus far. But that can change in a hurry here as we get ready to begin our second set. Ten for Teasdale. Four o'clock. Ten. Right by the side. And at nine for Gillen Payne, you see the wind really pick up while he has his bow drawn. He has a limit of 20 seconds to get that arrow shot. Ooh. That's a nine for Tease there. Score of 29 with one arrow for Gillespie. Yeah. Here's the 89 below the line. 28 to 29. Advantage Teasdale will pick up two points. And we are tied at two. Two. first this time because he started the thing.
for Brady Gallon Bean. And Teasdale answers with a nine. Mid-nine, 11 o'clock. Gallantine with a 10. And a 10 for Jean Teasdale. And that's a 9 for Brandon Gallantine. with a 10. Well done. 29-29, a tied set, one point for Excellent. each archer. Well Bringing their totals, three to three. Ten for Teasdale. Center X. Gallon Bean answers on a ten. Nine for Teasdale. Tied in the set. Low six o'clock. And a nine for Teasdale. Advantage Last two quite by low. one point in that set. Going to Brandon Gillen, being 29 to 28. He picks up two more points for a total of five to three. Brandon Gillen being tried to and He's had such a fantastic season. Uh, picking up individual wins in Ogden and in Croatia. 2010 Archery World Cup. Go nail it. Go nail it. Score of five to three. Brandon Gallantine can win this set. He'll win the match in advance to compete for the title. Low nine, five o'clock. Geez, that's her arrow at nine. Yeah! yeah. Be answered with a ten. Mmm, still a nine. And New Zealand's Teasdale with another nine. And Brayden Gillenkey with another 10 and smell his opportunity to get to the final. Good and shot. Teasdale ten. answers with a 10. Yeah. A 9 for Gillenkey, still enough to take the set. 
and match. Congratulations. So the Brigham Young team advances into the final round. He comes into the event ranked first in the World Cup rankings and has every intention of leaving Edinburgh, leading the World Cup rankings. And Sean Teasdale will advance into the consolation bracket, a hand for both of these world-class archers. Gallantine and Teasdale, we'll see them again later this afternoon. Wait till you get this word from um, Natalie. Okay, so uh, welcome on to East Princess Street, guys, if you have just joined us. Glad to see here, the weather is beautiful as ever. And we'll stay here all day as it always does in Edinburgh. Let's take a round of applause for Archers once again, everybody. It's the Arena, the semi-final. That's the USA Arena, uh, final later on this afternoon.